What is going on, guys? We are back with another video today, and we are doing, of course, our London Bulldogs Relocation Fantasy Draft franchise. It's week one going up against the Raiders. And I would say let's look at our schedule, but I'm going to be honest. I don't remember. I don't even remember half the players on our own roster, let alone the division, let alone the conference, let alone the entire league. So it's really going to mean absolutely nothing. I suppose we can look at how many nighttime games we have. Like, that's that's got to be cool, right? Like... Ooh, ah, oh yeah, I see, oh, so we got about five nighttime games and the rest are like one o'clock, I suppose I'd rather have the, the noon games or the late, I mean, I guess it's only two, but the four o'clock games I don't like because it's usually shadowy, any game, so in London that will be the, not snow, rain, Tennessee, that'll be, man, we are not going to have a single snow game, that is so depressing, not only is it week one, but this is the first time we've uh, streamed London Bulldogs franchise in like a week. And I would say leave a like, subscribe, and give us a round of applause. But that's not a, like a necessarily a good thing. Uh, it means I've been slacking on the YouTube upload. Well, upload for this. Like, I feel like I haven't been slacking, you know. Like, you know, I mean, if you think I've been slacking, f the light, no, they're not doing that. Let's uh, take a look at the team, which really hasn't changed a whole lot. We've we got some couple, you know, a couple of good defenders in case you missed the draft. There's not a lot you missed but it was kind of fun i suppose kind of uh so bo scarborough apparently is now our new fullback running backs like basically don't change we got archer back he wanted to leave and we said nope nope not a chance uh looking at the wide receivers uh, okay that's yeah, that's not really that great um look at the defensive side of things holton hill actually got an ability upgrade did we get cocked or did we get cocked Oh, wow. Pick artist is pretty bad, isn't it? Defenders with this ability have a higher chance to catch on to contested inner... Oh. Did they... Ch oh, I'm thinking of tip drill. That's not bad, actually. One step ahead is what I would like. Defenders with this ability have a higher chance to catch uncontested interceptions. But, like... In theory, if you're a corner, that, that should just be, like, your base ability, right? What's uh, Holton Hill's jumping? Does he have a good jump? Okay, I was gonna give him Acrobat. No hope. 76 jumping. Not a chance. I guess pick artist makes a lot of sense. We're not gonna we're not gonna cheese it too hard. What is Kemp's ability again? It's like some short route nonsense. Flat route, yeah, it's pretty good. And we didn't have to like change it or anything. Of course, one of the biggest things added was our Devin White, Devin Bush clone. And uh yeah, there he is. Super fast. Solid jumping, decent catching, really fast. I mean that's really all you can really ask for is is speed. Uh block lock returns, but he actually returns as a starter as Mario Williams is gone. Doesn't mean we can't bring in outside help. Maybe retired help. Hmm. We got a new kicker as well, Aldrich Rosas. We do have uh, De La Hay as uh, a backup. I suppose maybe injuries have. I'm not really sure what what's the thought process there. But let's take a look at the Raiders, who should be the Vegas Raiders. Where are they? Thank you. Dak Prescott at quarterback, and then the goat himself, Trubisky at backup. Derek Henry with. I thought it was Doug Martin. I was like, damn, Doug Martin still around here? Uh, I wouldn't say around here, but, you know, in, in the league. Brian Martin, what, what style player is he? Oh, he's one of those, like, typical, like, do-it-all players because apparently that's just so common these days. Uh, Justin Jefferson is their wide receiver. They have Anthony Miller at number two. Westbrook looking kind of fast, though. Melvin Patters, I don't remember him. We had him on our list, and thankfully we didn't take him. Will Disley, their offense is lacking. Becton really hasn't upgraded too much since year one. Uh, their offensive line, it's okay, I guess. I mean, it's kind of... I mean, we can handle it, right? We can deal with this D Ford, meh. Hairston, uh, kind of a meh. DT, who do they got? Some, they got to have somebody godly, right? Like, they must have, like, some gods. Their, their DB's got to be loaded, right? Adoree Jackson, I mean, it's not bad. Yo, what is this team? This is probably the worst roster in the league. This could actually be lower rated than ours. It's not. We're still the worst roster in the league. Love it. All right. The coach is already pissed. I don't understand what that is. Like, so basically this is like predictive, right? Like they're, they're like, okay, here's some highlights from the game that's happening, but we're coming back and you're going to see them, I guess. Is that? Okay. I, I guess. <laughs> uh, but yeah, this is obviously a very important game. Starting out strong. Going up against the Raiders, who who don't look very good, but apparently they're higher overall than us. But I feel like we have higher potential. I, I think that's also a lie. I don't think that's true. Imagine, 
imagine Parks would have gotten a star on that game and then would have gotten a superstar. It would have been sick. But it's not. <laughs> it's not. All right, Dakaliah Prescott. That's, that's interesting. Now, Callister looking for that, that hit early, and we've lost. Oh, my. Look at him. Oh, there you go, McAllister. I mean, he's going to slap a roo on him. To the outside, and oh, no. McAllister, though, kind of making Derrick Henry his little B, you know? Of course, looking at our draft class, we'd have Dom Williams. I don't know how much he's going to be playing. Enrique McAllister looking fresh to death already. He's crushing it. Gil Chris Williams. Okay, Williams is in. That's a tight end, so we'll allow it. And the McAllister on Henry. And there goes Dom Williams already getting crushed on the inside play. Mr. D.D. Westbrook. Third and one. Let's go with the blitz. See if we can get there. Chason's already playing a lot of coverage. I know he's probably not going to here, but can we get more in the central here? I guess we don't need... We stopped him. I was about to say we don't need it. In fairness, Derrick Henry, you know, he's a powerful guy, and we've already seen that in, uh, in display. Very sadly to say so. But he, it does take him a little bit of time to get going, so... The fact that, oh my, the fact that we like got there instantly, you can see why we stopped him somehow when only one yard and was needed. All right, Parks, 93 throw power, you know, pretty average ratings, but he's got the throw power, he's got the speed, he's got the look. I love it. I, I just, I just don't. Oh, look at King, and it meant nothing. Sweet. Bush to the outside. I guess Parm. We got to remember, like, even though it's a new season, it's still going to be kind of the same old us, right? Like, we're not going to be able to to really get away with you know too much down the field passing we we ran the ball well we threw it short that's kind of what got us going down the, the stretch uh oh and that's just air trucking mr uh who is that cunningham is super star did not expect that at all parks probably got a little too conservative there we did throw it low and uh i mean aiken caught it but Overall, yeah, we kind of sold. We probably left a little bit of yards on the books. Slant to Ake. Ooh, kind of pass interfered a little bit. Going a little conservative, going a little sad mode. I believe to the outside. Oh, Bo, you son of a gun. I don't know how the hell <laughs> Scotty Miller got two on that, but he did. Bush, Albert O kind of got, like, scammed. Like, there was actually a shot for him to, to potentially... Oh, please, King. Thank you. King run. Oh, what a tackle. For him to actually potentially start just because, like, he seemed to get open even faster somehow, which is crazy to believe, than uh, Mr. Donald Parham. Oh, I should have taken him. Oh, Parks has got room. Give me the block. Oh, I couldn't trust it. Aiken did make the right choice. He kind of he kind of left his uh, left arm over the, the shoulder and... He kind of covered the other guy. He almost got both of them. He almost he almost did it. Now we can't. Where's the run at? Mr. Dillon. Dillon for the touch on easy money. Blocking was superb there. You gotta remember, we should have been in the Super Bowl. You know, we played way better teams in this down the stretch. And I mean, I expect a good day today. Whether we win or not, I expect at least a decent showing. Right, let's keep the outsides covered. Oh, no shot. And yeah, then again, it is. Derrick Henry he makes he makes McAllister look tiny, but McAllister's had his number, and he's going. Ah, oh, okay. oh, that's a good play call. Look at Flowers getting aggressive though. That's what we like to see around here. How yeah, about that? Finally catching the scream hype. What is up? Third and six. Dom Williams. Perfect coverage to the outside. Oh, Williams all over. Don't you dare touch him. I don't even want to look at him. If I even look at Jefferson, they get foul. That is, please not picked. Woo -hoo! There's no one open on that one. That's just great coverage, decent bit of pressure. Third and twenty-four. We got to get back to the ground game. We've already, uh, we've already abandoned it. I know we're risking a pick, and that's that's what happens. <laughs> I don't know why I felt like, yeah, it's okay. If you know, we would have had a punt anyways. It's not okay. It really isn't. If <laughs> it wasn't in my head, I was like, okay, as long as we get this ball down 45 yards, that's fine. Nope, it, did, it didn't work out that well. It was weirdly like overthrown and underthrown at the same time. I don't know how that was physically possible, but Parks just does it. He's just, he's really good. Oh, we're going against Jeff. Jeff Forson. 
Oh, come on. How am I supposed to cover him? He's a freaking wide receiver. All right, everyone, come up. Come up. The first quarter's ending, and I'm sad. I mean, we're winning, but, like, does it really feel like I'm winning? Is that Duval making the turn? All right, blitz it. Blitz it again. I don't, I don't believe Dak has the juice. There you go. I don't believe Dak has the juice. So you just defend the run. I just don't like the curl look. We always get destroyed in the curls. So in theory, right? In theory, the man coverage, it's, it should be a little bit better. Like the zones, literally, there, there's holes. But at least if we press man, then it's going to be kind of hard for them to get too much separation. Superstar of the middle's open. Oh, Dom Williams' his knees. His ankles are gone. Did we stop him? Oh, man, what a try. We do not have a run defense set up. There we go. Good containment. Is that Julian Love on the play? Who I am honestly surprised was in. I know we do have a lot of DBs there. Stop asking me questions, game. Get in there, Flowers. Good tackle, Duval. Duval? Where did this guy go to tackle camp? Where is this tackle camp, McGee? They should, they should put him on as the poster child. Show him tackling Derrick Henry after last season's performances. Oh, we are getting destroyed. Duval! He's a god! What has happened? Then again, this happens a lot. The first couple of weeks, he is literally like Ed Reed reincarnated. And then he just turns into like Kentrell Bryce. He's actually not so. Oh, here we go. We got to go for the spin move here. Woo! Oh, God. Who is that? D Ford. <laughs> More like D's nuts. First down. Got him. Let's do it. Uh oh. Okay. okay. I'm not going to say who, s who tackled us there. Because I prefer not to be canceled. Thank you very much. Up oh, the middle. Nah, we can't run it here. We we sold too hard. Oh, the play action there looks really good though. We gotta get Aikens. Aiken as the uh the the deep ball man. I'm gonna get his, I'm throwing, and he was open. The pressure was just so immense that I literally couldn't even get the ball off. How are they destroying us? D Ford is a freaking glitch, dude. Like, can you not be so good somehow magically? I don't understand how he does it anyways. That's not bad. Woo! Woo! Aiken. Oh, my God. How does he bring that in? I'll trust the damn streak with him. I know we're intersecting the tight ends a little bit. I had Parham, but you know what I don't have? Nah, screw it. <laughs> you know what I don't have? Faith to hit that throw on the run. That's what I don't have. But I suppose you can't always just run on first down, then they'll always stop you. So we're going to risk it on second, and there's no blocking. Dylan is going to fight, though, and gain about three or four. Not bad. Four-yard gain, considering everyone forgot that they have to block on run plays. Scotty Miller, and I really thought that was overthrown. You just cannot really tell how fast Scotty Miller is until you realize how fast Scotty Miller is. That's really it. They read it. Dylan is going to get credit for... Holy crap, how many people is this guy going to fight? What is this, Aaron Donald? Out of what, where was when was he when he got that fight? All right, here's a play action look. I really like Aiken on this play. I d I don't understand how you illegally contact a player and then it's just like, nah, it's not a penalty though. Like, I timed it perfectly because I know unless he jumps it, he's not gonna be able to stop it because you can't just hold the guy. But what does he do? All right, all right, Parham. Good throw. Let him out there. Instead of using the big body, he just literally just had to catch it. Nice. There's another read option. He's got a chance to score. Oh, my God, Parks. You want to start running, pal? Can we get Albert Owen out, out there? Out. Albert. Damn it. Okay, I guess not. That is the biggest sell of Parham's career. That is an absolute hot one. Coming straight out of the hands of Mr. Parks. And he just... Straight up drops it. What is that? Bo Scarborough up the middle, fighting hard. It's I mean it's Dylan, but I wouldn't even say smaller. I think they're about the same size. Oh, there's no one on King. Wide open touchdown. We up 14. Well, we need the shot. Derrick Henry, 8 for 29. They're obviously trying to get the ground game going, which you do with when you have Derrick Henry, but so far it hasn't really gone so well. It hasn't done it. Oh, good cutback, but Kind of an, un, you know, more of a forced cutback rather than a choice 
And uh, Dom Williams gets in there. Nice. There might be a space in between. I'm not sure. Uh oh, he's got a chance over top. I mean, there's not much Kemp can do. How long does it take? All right, Kirkpatrick. Inside leverage. Oh, he's got him. I can't hit him, though. Brooks, nice solid tackle. See, they work. They're just, you know, a little tricky. I can't believe they actually have Dak with five wide receivers. It seems like too much pressure for him. Okay, that's why they're just going to go short. Well, a couple people. Oh, there you go. Chase on. Is that the first sack of the season? I'll let the clock go. We got to keep the three timeouts, honestly. Deontay Harris on the return. Aw. Does he not have return, man? What kind of... How is that return, man? That's trash, man. Oh, we can go deep with Bush. I kind of believe it. We had a couple people open, but Albert O is the safer bet as he just runs it down. And why didn't I go to bounds? I don't know. Indeed, it could be an Aiken shot. You gotta take that. That could be a home run ball. It's under throw. No, Parks, you moron. Aiken gave you it all and you sold him down the river. Oh, that's what pre-half plays like that are for. You take the shot and he sells. Kirk. Oh, man. Oh, Duvall was like, nah, you ain't going down easy. I'm going to kill you. McAllister ain't messing around. This man is going to kill someone. And honestly, they need to ban him from the league before he does. All right, so halftime, they do get a field goal. I mean, that's cool, but, like, no one cares. Like I said, you know, we showed up against the Bills in the championship round. Should have won. Waller got lucky. They got lucky. A team like this should be a walk in the park. I know we're not the greatest team in the round. Ah! slant -roo. Oh, hell no. How is he throwing that ball? He, I get it's a deep shot. It's not easy. You know, you, I wouldn't say pinpoint accuracy was needed on the throw, but... It's not easy, but he hits that. How is he hitting that, but missing the throw to the guy? You know? Damn it. To the outside. I can't trust anything else. The, the, the routes are really strange. Like, it seems like it's so weird that that guy got open there. It's like almost like we're playing backyard football in this one. Like, the Raiders just don't know what the hell they're doing. As long as we just don't sell, you know, I... <laughs> When I was saying don't sell and I had a chance to fumble from a hit, I was out of there. I mean, that's a good play call, but I just don't trust screens at all. And there goes King trying to cut it back right using the block from Scotty Miller, I believe. And he takes it to the 32. We're a run-heavy team now. It is just all day. All day long with this. Dylan fighting hard for an 11 or 12-yard gain. Really would like to see Dylan go to Superstar. Imagine him with freaking bulldozer that'd be insane i'm not gonna run it from the left to the right we need all the space we can get oh my god dylan you just you just sold that's a freaking touchdown we don't even need your block i get he was trying to help but you didn't you know like that's terrible oh i tried to cut it back all the way right didn't think uh, it was an andrew thomas was gonna leave it that much they're down, could be looking to run, and we are looking to run. And we're going to be looking to cut it inside, and we're going to slide it down to the seven-yard line. What a play. Already at 5,000 yards rushing, right? Interiorly. Oh, that's a walk-in again for Dylan. Too easy. They're the same, aren't they? <laughs> no, they're not. You can tell the difference for sure. McAllister is nowhere near as thick as our, uh, our boy Gilchrist. Over the middle. No, he's going to sell out for the run. And he's gonna slide late. I would have, I would have Kiko Alonso, Joe Flacco, his ass. I'm just saying, do that. Come on, man. Curl route, curl route, slant, drag, curl route. Get, get it, get it, get off. Brooks gonna tackle him. I mean, there, there's a lot of clock being wasted here, without a doubt. But still, I don't want to see them have any sort of chance. You know what happens when, when we give up even a sliver ounce of a shot, we give them it all. I sold out hard. That play action actually crushed my soul. It was so good. I actually thought they were going to run it. I almost hit-sticked him miles late. Good tackle, but it's just like, is that all they're going to play? Coach adjustment, cornerback matchups by overall uh, zone flat drop to zero. 
I might actually have to drop our hooks to zero or five at least. Because like, they just don't take any shots over the middle anyway, so like, why not? Yeah, that's our coverage in fairness. No chance. I know we did get destroyed, but... Damn it, man. These flats. We got to actually run flats or something. They just crush us. I think we got to blitz everyone. That's not true. I think we had the press, though. I still can't believe we didn't get that throw to Aiken. Such a sell. Look at Parks, though. He is just thriving. In what a slide, buddy. He's thriving in this read-op heavy situation. But you're looking for Aiken. Set the... F Can I set the feet, please? That was such a smart play for us to do that, right? Like, who expects a, a shot play on second and inches? I think a lot of teams. But they didn't, and I wanted to exploit that. Dylan up the middle. Especially when you got a guy like Dylan who's just going to gain yards, right? I can't take Bo. I don't care how much he knows. There you go. Aiken. I mean, I feel like we're cheesing the hell out of him with these, like, roll-out, sprint-out, run-nonsense plays. Oh, come on, man. Oh, these running backs are too fat. I can't take... What am I taking this for? What a disaster. Aiken just stopped running his route. It's so bad. If I'm going to take a stupid shot, I should just throw it to Parham. What a debut of the, the season. Oh, what a block, uh, press. All over him with Dom. And that's just a coverage sack. Parsons, good stuff. Oh, I can't believe Parks missed that throw before halftime, though. I know that has nothing to do with it, just what happened, but I really wanted that play. McAllister, I mean, he has the coverage, right? I'm going to leave him in there. Oh, he got, that was a good kind of, like, pick play-ish. McAllister was all over him until, uh, until that happened. Damn it, Par not Parsons, that's not the guy. Come on, grab him. McCallis are going to have like 45 tackles a game at this rate. Man, they are just ready for the run, but we're going to do it anyways. I mean, they really weren't, but uh, our guys weren't either, apparently. Scotty should drink. Drink? That, that's not even a word. Bring enough pressure, right? And he drops it. I got to give it to number uh, 21. Jordan Lewis has been, he's been in pretty good coverage for the majority of the game. Damn, Parks. I want to get that someone on target. No. Tom Williams has played okay, to be fair. But obviously the star of the show so far is McAllister, as we all expected. And Williams, yeah, not bad. A tight end with his smaller self. It's not easy to cover. Bring a blitz off the edge. Bring in Williams. Guy is in. Kirkpatrick getting doubled because he's like the star of the show. Good tackle by McAllister. He's just so formed. Oh, wide open on the outside. Wow, wide open over the middle. Hill just cannot hit stick. It sucks because he's so big. So when I see him coming in, I'm like, okay, he can kill a guy, but... Nope. No shot. Oh, that is faked us out hard. Tom with the save, though. Not a bad call. Not a bad call at all, but of course, Dom the rookie coming in clutch on that one. That was, that was some play. Oh, somebody's got to get him. There you go. Dom! He's so tiny. He made the catch. What a play. Flowers making a play, but he's going the wrong way. And he will be short. So there's more time off the clock. But they are surely getting close there. McAllister again. If this man doesn't have at least 10 tackles, I, I feel whoever's counting is just not counting well enough. McAllister and company. Oh, he just crushed us. Damn. Well, I mean, the Raiders are within. I always say, like, oh, how do the AIs always sell in the second half? It's like, well, we're now the AIs, aren't we? Like, we're doing these things. There you go. Pick it up, somebody. Oh, you picked that up and score, and we're up seven with ball? That's early. I thought he was going to come after us. <laughs> I guess Marcus May was content with giving up the first down. Okay. You're a bot. They can't harm you anymore, Jerome. You've gotten them. He literally cannot return from your burn. Good job. I don't understand. Oh, man. Cunningham is making plays today. King could be my guy. 
that's pretty easy. Nobody covered Scotty there. I mean, in fairness, Scotty's probably not the guy when it comes down to third down specifically. Formation's pretty silly. He's silly formation. And it's not that they can cover it in general. Got to bring at least four there, right? I mean, a field goal, if we hit it, puts us up eight, so... I mean, don't get me wrong. It would have been nice to, to win with a little bit more dignity. But hey, a win is a win. I can't believe some of these missed throws, though. Good cut back, and once again, is that Cunningham making plays? Because a field goal, even though it does put us up in a decent lead. Now let's run it again. Try to cut it back right. It's going to hurt us out what's going to open up. That Aiken is just, that's such a sell play, isn't it? That is a really good attempt at a bait by them, but he couldn't get over their time. We got the dart in there, and that will be the ceiling dagger. Not the ceiling dagger. That sounds dangerous. Victory. We've done a victory. 21 to 16. What an absolute score, though. Oh, man. Nice pick. That's actually a cool little animation thing. Duvall came up clutch in this game, though. Some of the hit sticks he had. McAllister, I would love to see these tackles. McAllister might have to be the prediction next week if we remember to because, uh, Jesus, he was all over the place. Absolutely crushed it. Actually just covering everybody. I don't know how he's done that. I just don't. It's just insane. I got to see these tackles. McAllister had to have, like, 13 or something. We don't like to look at the stats. Okay, the, the stats are just, like, what are stats anyways? Of course, we ran the ball a lot better than they... Ooh, they did, considering they have Derrick Henry receiving. Aiken would have had so much more if we would have got that throw out. Maybe I just didn't throw it quick enough, because, of course... Now, Parks has 93 throw power. He should have hit that. He should have hit that throw, and uh, he didn't, unfortunately. But I suppose Aiken still was the number one receiver. Parham had... A, you know, Parham's seeming a little slow. I know he's young still, but... Looking a little slow out there. Got a sack for Parsons. Got a sack for Chase on. A couple of pressures up the middle. Duvall with a pick. Jordan Lewis with two. Elliott with one. Kind of just default picks. No, like, crazy plays. Just some bad throws, honestly. And uh, we did not see the tackles for our guy. 11 total tackles. What a ball. Six solo, five assist. McAllister going to be that man. The tackle meister. So, yeah, definitely not exactly the way I thought it was going to go, but we did win, you know, talking this whole, like, oh, the Raiders aren't that good of a team, yet yeah, we almost choked against them. We didn't really look too sharp. I know Parks missed a couple of throws. We missed a couple of reads. Some of the re receivers aren't, you know, running great routes, but, yeah, I mean, I, I mean, we'll see. Hopefully week two we get a breakout because, I don't know, McAllister played pretty well. Dom Williams played okay. Duvall actually had a pretty good game. Aiken was okay. Parks was, you know, he can run good. <laughs> but obviously we'll have to see for week two, which ironically enough, we will probably be doing tonight live on Twitch.tv slash Jerome Care. So maybe check it out. And of course, I do have an MLB poll up in the community tab right now. So if we get enough uh, engagement on that, I may just drop the 85 or whatever dollars they have for the early access bull crap even though i could wait four days for free on game pass it is what it is uh i'm not a, like a huge mlb fan but if you guys want to see it it could be a lot of fun i don't know something new uh it definitely getting me to think at least more about getting 2k at launch so we'll see regardless thanks for watching should be something up on the second channel and hopefully you guys come back for next video but until next video